guys, it's the Rock Collector. How do you like that intro, huh? Yeah, uh, so if you don't know, I am the Rubik's Cuber. I own Charlie the Cat. Official, Charlie the Cat official, the CTC line of animations. Um, and this is a new channel I'm starting today, so yay, new channel. Uh... I will be filming at this desk, which is where I have all my rocks and stuff. Uh, not my Rubik's Cube desk, which isn't really a desk, it's just like a glass display table. Anyways, to prove that I am that person, I can show you the original Charlie the Cat 1 script. The original Charlie the Cat 1. And I can show you a Rubik's Cube with Rubik's. Here we go. This is Rubik's Cuber Premium. Monkey logo and all. So yeah, hopefully that proves it to you. So anyways, in this video, uh, if you've read my about page, I am obsessed with quartz, yes. This right here is a piece of tangerine quartz which i just got recently on my trip to on my vacation to charleston uh what's it called charleston south carolina i uh, i got it at a little rock shop and this is a great it's it looks really good that rock place sold so many different crazy rocks so i didn't really know what one to pick so I just picked something cheap. This was seven bucks. Up th this was seven bucks. So, uh, yeah, this was, this I feel like it's pretty cool because it's like not cut down super far and polished. It's not, e it's like, it's not even polished. You can like feel like the grit and stuff on it. Like I have a piece of smoky quartz, which uh, is from the Smoky Mountains, I believe. Actually, no, it wasn't found in the Smoky Mountains. I think it was found in Lincoln Caverns. Uh, let me just grab it. I have a piece of normal quartz here, but that one's, like, pure from the dirt. Okay. Oh, God, did it crack? Oh, no. Did it crack? Oh, wait, no, it didn't crack. That's just how it is. <laughs> Alright, so this is a piece of smoky quartz. Up here it's not polished, but down here it's polished really well. Did it crack? I swear there was more. Okay, whatever. <laughs> I don't remember that. I think it might have cracked. Um, but, yeah, because it had a point on either end. <laughs> oh well. Maybe it's just because it was buried under a bunch of other rocks. But anyways, uh, this right here is smoky quartz, which is like purple quartz and tangerine quartz is tangerine colored you can see through it sort of you can't really see through this one in real life you can a little bit but not a lot uh but anyways i was just gonna review this rock and compare it to this rock the size is a little bit different the smoky quartz is a little bit larger than this piece both lengthwise and thickness uh, and then, uh, which one is, which one do I like better? I like the Smoky Quartz better because I, because it's bigger, I guess, and it was a little bit cheaper than this. This was $7, and it's smaller than this, which this was only $5, so this one's cheaper even though it's bigger. Maybe it's cheaper because that happened. <laughs> uh, anyways, and it. I can't find smoky quartz where I live. As a matter of fact, I was able to find a little bit of tangerine quartz in this piece of quartz I ha in this piece of quartz I found at a little tiny beach, like by a creek. Uh, it's a piece of quartz, and it has a bit of tangerine quartz right in the middle of it. So that was pretty cool. Anyways, that is pretty much it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you all next time. But, before I leave, I would like to say tomorrow I will have a clock tutorial on how to solve the clock out on my Rubik's Cuber channel. And, on March 1st, there will be Fatty Sings a Party. 
I made this a while ago. It's like Charlie the Cat back when I made Charlie the Cat books instead of uh, Charlie the Cat animations. Anyways, bye.